Alex Cobb, you know, four-year deal uh, gotten. Uh, he received a four-year deal from the Baltimore Orioles. Um, people were saying, people, some people were saying, listen, that he's just another three-and-a-half ERA guy pitching against the likes of Yankees lineup and the Red Sox lineup. Do the Orioles still have a number one guy? If you're an Oriole fan, are you 100% confident in that rotation? And I'll tell you guys this, okay? There is only... There's only like a guy like Kershaw and Stroman who are actual number ones. You know, uh, maybe maybe even four or five pitchers right now in the league that are lights out. And none will ever, ever want to be a pitcher in a hitter-friendly park. Yeah, I want to lose ten million to show that I could hurl in a sandbox. Let's get real, guys, right? He's a career 350 ERA in the AL East. In today's world, you know, let's face it, Cobb and Kashner, both with those ERAs around three and a half or three point six, are good. The days I think the days I think of two and a half, three are long gone, along with starters who throw uh, 22 complete games. Uh, baseball has changed. It's changing. When we find that only one of these guys can become a number one pitcher or stay at a number two pitcher, perhaps. Until we got them, you didn't have a number two pitcher at all. Last year, TRA, team ERA was 5.7. And not one was even at major league, you know, wordy pitcher. So this is a huge improvement. Much of the appeal attached to Cobb centers on his experience and comfort with the division. He's six and four with a three point four three ERA and one point two five four WHIP. In 14 starts, you know, against the Red Sox, six and four, with 2.9 ERA and .996 WHIP. In 14 starts against the Yankees and three point uh, three three and three, with a 2.33, uh, actually a 3.23 ERA, I believe, and 1.056 WHIP. In eight starts versus the Blue Jays, you see where I'm getting here. He's gone six and two with a two seven ERA and one point two WHIP, and twelve starts against the Orioles. End of the day, point I'm trying to make with this video. He's a great addition that solidifies, considering the way pitching is now. It kind of solidifies this rotation for the Orioles. Hope all is well. Look forward to speaking to you soon.